53 years wasn't enough for Nada and Neil. The couple so in love, they planned on spending eternity together. 87-year-old Nada wanted to be buried with her late husband's ashes. But cruel thieves tried to rob her of that chance, stealing Neil's ashes and her engagement ring. Nada and her daughter Joan join me now. Thank you so much for joining me, Nada. You lost your beautiful husband, Neil, in 2016. I can't believe his ashes were taken, but you've got some good news for us. Yes, the police returned the ashes this morning. Uh, they kind of sprung a surprise, really. Lo and behold, he had a, a, a proper brown paper shopping bag and he brings out the whole urn. Oh, it, w it was just hard to believe that they could mm located so soon. Mm. Nada, what did it mean to you to have your husband Neil back, to have him home? Well, it, it means everything because we planned so many years ago that we would both be cremated and both go into the family um, plot at Nudgee. Joan, you saw how distressed your mum was when the ashes were stolen. The urn was left at a nearby church, we're mm. told. How do you feel about having mm. them back? And I'm assuming that's what I'm looking at between you there, right now. Yes, yes, Dad, Dad is back. He is back with us where he belongs. I was just beyond thrilled when Mum called to let me know. And, I mean, it's... It's, it's funny that it was left at a church because um, our father was a very religious man, so um, we find that particularly apt. And we're just so very, very grateful that his remains have been handed in and returned to us. Because it's been a really rough couple of days, hasn't it? In many ways, Joan, you've had to relive oh. the pain of losing your dad all over again and Nada, your husband. That's right. That's exactly how it has felt. In fact, I think that this was even more disturbing than when he died in 2016 because um, at, at this point we felt like we had lost him forever, that he was, that he was truly gone. And um, we're just so happy to have him back and be able to fulfil his lifetime wish to be interred with our mother eventually. Um, in their family plot. Yeah. Nada, why was Neil such a special man? Oh, because he, he was such a, a, a good, considerate, thoughtful uh, family man. I couldn't have asked for anything better, really. Nada, to know that someone broke into your home, they took the urn, they also took your engagement and eternity rings, how much has that shaken you? Mm -hmm. Nothing like this has ever happened to me before. Nothing, nothing anywhere near this. And I always thought that my home was mm. totally secure. So it's been, it's been absolutely devastating. Uh, my eldest son and I are kind of looking into how we can make it more secure. I mean, Joan, thank goodness your mum wasn't home at the time, but so frightening that her place was ransacked in broad daylight. Yes. Mm -hmm. Well, that was, that was one thing for which we were very, very grateful, that mum was not here at the time. Um, but it really has rattled her. And uh, tell mm. me... How do you feel about the person or people who did this? You're kind of trying to figure out what's, what sort of people would do this, mm. you know. However, they must have had, well, as the policeman said, they must have had some sort of conscience to, um, to drop the, uh, the urn off at the church. Something, something... There must have been some good in that person to realise what they'd taken, which they certainly didn't need, and, and, to, uh, and to take it to a church. Joan, is this just your mum to a T, though, being able to find good in everyone? Um, not 
always, but I'm, I'm very pleased to hear her um, saying this yeah. <laughs> now. So, mm. but you know, that's that's because we are just feeling so very grateful to yeah. have had Dad return to us. He's home where he belongs, isn't he? Oh, for sure. Mm. Yeah. Well, Nardo, it is a beautiful love story that you have, and we're just so pleased to know that Neil is back home with you where he belongs. Thank you. Thank you, Ali. Thank you, Ali. And let's hope Nada can get her rings back too. If you have any information that might help police, please call Crime Stoppers on 1800 333 000.